Hello friends, it's Andrew again with you and our sharpening system MadEdge. I apologize for not posting new videos for a long time. I had a lot of work as usual and scientific activity is not the least, as you know. Today I want to present you one of the latest additional options of our sharpening system. Exactly above the opportunity to adjust the angle of the clamp within 0.5 grades. Especially, I want to draw attention of the producers of sharpening systems to implement it. What for it's needed? It's needed to get the maximum symmetry of the cutting edge during sharpening. It's also needed for blades with complex geometry. This option will allow them to adjust the cutting edge more symmetrically. How it looks like in practice, I'll show you now and will tell you about this in details. Thanks to constructive improvement of our clamps, we can either lower the axis of the clamp or raise it. For example, we need to lower the axis of the clamp a little bit. We free this screw a little, it attaches the clamp to the frame. We twist the screw with the hex key, screw in, the screw is located in the upper clamp, screw in to the floor. If you remember before this, we had 23.1 grades on the angle meter, now we've screwed it in, now the angle meter shows 23.5, it means we've lowered the axis of our clamp 0.4 grades below. So if we need to raise the axis of our clamp, we screw out the upper screw and screw in the lower one. It will raise the axis of the clamp. Now I'll turn off the angle meter. Done. I'll take off our rod and twist the clamps to you for you to see them. Here they are, a little closer. Look, friends, the screw threaded bore is done both in the bottom and in the upper clamp. Accordingly, if we need to lower the axis of the clamp, we screw in the screw of the upper clamp and screw out it in the lower clamp. If you need to raise the axis of the clamp, we screw out the upper and screw in the lower one. It allows us to raise and lower the clamp as we need within 0.5 grades. That is all, friends. Thanks for your attention. See you soon.